The North Dakota High School State Football Playoffs kick off tonight for 11-man 2A. And the West Fargo Cheyenne Mustangs are carrying that top seed and undefeated record into tonight's quarterfinal matchup with Minot. The regular season matchup with a 37-point 30, shutout for the Mustangs. They pick up where they left off. Cheyenne with the option on the goal line pitched out to race Wilson. Wilson diving over the pylon for the fourth score of the game. Mustangs up by six. They're going to go for two here, lining up in the swinging gate and tossing it out to Joshua Hendricks. Hendricks adds two more for Cheyenne. They lead it 8-9. Nothing. The Braves moving into Mustang territory on the very next drive, lining up on fourth down here, and the run is stuffed by Theron Parson to force the turnover on downs. Cheyenne marching right back down the field now. The drive capped off on the goal line. Hendricks with the run right up the gut and onto the painted turf. The Mustangs lead 15-0 after the first quarter, and they go on to win it 28-6, moving on to the semifinals. The Mustangs will play the winner of this matchup between Shanley and Mandan in the next round. The Deacons opening up the scoring on their first drive. Aiden Devine takes the toss to the outside and leaps into the score. Devine getting into the end zone the hard way as Shanley leads 7-0. Mandan taking the field now for their first drive. Max Carlson launches the pass downfield, but it falls into the wrong hands. Landon Meyer going up and getting the interception to give it back to the Deacons near the end of the quarter now. We are tied at 7, but not for long. Michael Rosberg grabs the low snap and fires a quick pass to Isaac Emineth to reclaim their lead. Shanley at 14-7, the Deacons advancing with a 35-20 win. They have a date with Cheyenne in the semifinals. The West Fargo Packers hosting Bismarck Legacy on the other half of the bracket. Near the end of the opening half, Peyton Jancy rolling out looking for an open target. But this pass is picked off by Mitchell Wald to shut down that drive. The Packers carrying a 13-0 lead into halftime. It wouldn't take long for the Packers to find the end zone again in the second half on the very first offensive play. Pa Parker Nelson takes this handoff 85 yards to the house. The long touchdown run putting the Packers up by 19. After recovering an onside kick, the Packers back in scoring range. Jancy drops back and finds an open Jaden Gruff. Grefsrud to add another score. The Packers lead it 26 0 in the third quarter. They add another five and lock up the shutout to advance. They'll see the winner of Bismarck and Bismarck Century. First quarter, Century was forced to punt their first possession on their second. Brady Dahl is able to get around the edge and into the end zone for the 23 yard scamper. Extra point was good. Patriots led 7 0. Next drive. A big run from Peyton Arndt sets Brady Dahl up for his second score of the night. Going off his left guard, Century led it 14-0 after one, and they just keep it rolling. Logging a 28-point shutout for the win, Century will host West Fargo next week in the semifinals. Well, be sure and stick around after the break. More football as North Dakota single A squares off on the gridiron.